yesterday was April 12th and now that school has started activity has ceased so let's go through here up the stairs and through some magic we're suddenly in front of a castle that's not currently properly decorated you can see that we are using seamless teleportation here we have night day and a cool feature about him is that while he talks and when you run away he gets displeased but he can still listen to his dialogue and currently you can push him around you desire an explosive will deliver on your quest shortly and then so this is going to be the trivia lobby as you can see there's the guest lounge where you can access the other mini games and then this is just for decoration and see he has finished his talking and once you run away from him he will say goodbye but he won't be displeased say you need to go to the bathroom but as a guest of course you must go to the guest bathroom which is at the top of the stairs no big deal we'll just like go up it Now this staircase is quite long. Let's see, what's at the top of it? Oh, it doesn't go, even go anywhere. Well, that's because, as you can see, we're using seamless teleportation to make the stairs infinite. Uh, let's go up here. Um, let's go up the stairs a bit. Okay, and then let's go back down. You can see that we're back on the first floor. Down here, uh, we hint at the uh, puzzle branch by saying access to the laboratory laboratories are limited to class B personnel or higher. I will see the developments in that area later. And this area is not done yet. Hello, night day. And let's walk back. Yes, night day likes to talk. Let's head to the puzzle branch. Here you can see that there's a lot of pink concrete. And this is because Steven is also going to attempt to employ seamless teleportation in the form of a shifting maze. Okay, so I believe that this should work. So if we enter here, the shifting maze, currently with temporary pink concrete, and then if we walk around, now you won't really notice much. It's just a plain old maze. Mm. Is there anything special? Oh, it looks like the way that we came from has disappeared. And you can see that there is no more um, route back to the main area. It's quite cool. I like it. Something I forgot to show yesterday was um, that the black concrete was removed and I believe in the process Brandon accidentally ripped off one face of the house which he has repaired. So it seems like the large concrete slab has been produced above the boss battle but it seems like Brandon does has been working on his boss battle uh, commands this time uh, despite being rather busy. So if we TP into the area and press the lever, you can see that it auto-detects it and pulls down the gate. And then it summons the boss with a nice sound. And there's some sounds. And it speaks as well, which is pretty cool. As you can see, it's uh, Nikodon, the guy who stole the dragon egg from the beginning. As you can see, as part of the their efforts of hiding the command box, they built a tower here because it's currently visible from uh, the ravine parkour down here.
Okay, well, those are the honey spikes. Hardcore. Exciting. 